What's up, all you people out there? Welcome, welcome to another Soul Hunters episode. Sorry to be so up and um, uh, up and personal, invading your privacy, but you gotta pay attention to this. Why? Because what I'm gonna be teaching you guys is a lot of experience. Yes, if you need the experience, you've come to the right place. All right, so what I'm gonna do today, guys, is do a bunch of my dailies that I normally do. I'm gonna do some arenas. And I haven't played the game yet at all today, so we're gonna try some things out. I have a good amount of gold, so I'm probably gonna do a shit ton of uh, gold chests. Yeah, the golden chests. The best kind. Holy fuck, I've been dropped. I just realized that that was. Yep, that says 43. This fucking guy dropped me 24 spots. This guy right here. Alright, buddy. I'm gonna give him a taste of his own medicine and hopefully I don't lose. So let's watch this. We have the same fucking team. Ah, this is the thing that I starting to starting to suck about Soul Hunters. Everybody has the same goddamn uh, heroes. And it's just luck. Whether he beats me or I beat him, it's all luck. We're both enchanted. Everybody's been at the same level for a long time now. You know, and it's just a matter of luck. So, let's see if I'm lucky today. Let's see if I feel lucky. Alright, so, so far, so even. Ah, it's still even. Come on. Slim. You Fuck, you couldn't even take out Celine in one hit? Oh my god, that's gonna be bad. I'm hoping that Gale will just kill everybody. Come on! Ah! Oh, take that, you fucking piece of shit. Pardon my language, guys. What the hell is this? Yes. I thought it didn't, you know, record the battle or something like that. Alright, so let's keep it moving here. Let's go to the Epic Arena and see what's going on. Man, I've been again attacked from all different angles here. Jesus Christ, dude. Mm, trying to find... Oh, there he is. I want to attack the same guy that got me back. Bring him back to his original spot. Come on, where was he? No. No. The name of, I think it's the most um, chaos. Chaos. What the? I guess when you really, really want to find somebody, you just... Unless they got beaten and was sent back. I know he's got to be here somewhere. Alright, if he doesn't come in five tries, I'm finding somebody else. Four. Three. Two. One. Ah, this guy's in my guild. I can't attack him. Jew. Jew back. Alright, this guy's going to get it. Sorry, Jew back. But, I have to attack you, and hopefully you don't win. Alright, so this team I've been using a lot, I like the composition of the team, the only problem is that our, I think uh, the name is our Arturo, Ar Arturos, the Ice Dragon there, he's kind of low. You know, he's only three stars. But he does do a pretty good job of defending the team well. Alright, let's do this. Man, it's so slow. Yes! Round one is in the books. Let's go for round two here now. Get ready for round two. 
shit. This team is not a great team. This is actually my my, my weakest team here. As you can see, one, two, three, three stars, one, four star. And Esabel is my other one. But looks like he's got his weak team here too, so it might work out for me here. Yeah, this looks like that's his weak team too, huh? Alright. Come on, let's do this. Alright, yes! Wow, that one is a win. Alright guys, we're off to a good start. 2-0. 2-0. Let's check out the trader here real quick. Trader. Make sure you always get purple, orange items, you know, things like that. Alright, let's give the dojo a shot. Today is Sunday, yes. Sunday fun day, everything is open. We can stock up on everything. Love Sundays. Alright, I'm gonna do five of these. Because I want the destruction sword. I've been working on my Hanzo now because from the last Hall of Legend, I noticed that Hanzo was kicking butt. So definitely gotta work on my Hanzo. My Hanzo sucks. It's only like four stars and like purple plus one. So I don't even know if it's even worth starting it. I mean, I'm doing it anyways, but it's gonna take such a long time. All right, let's see. The reason why I'm doing expert is because a lot of the items in expert, you need them way more. Not way more, but you need them more than you do in the um, extreme. Even though it's only one item off in both, between expert and extreme, like I'll show you here. Expert, we have uh, this thing, Titan Axe, Grim Slasher, and Ghostly Mantle. And let's see, in extreme, we have Titan Axe, Grim Slasher, and you have the bow. That's it. So, depending on if you need the bow or you need that Ghostly Mantle thing, that's the one that you kind of want to raid all right i think that's everybody on the raids so that's great bountiful caverns here let's make some money and some potions all right so now for all you younger you know not younger but Lower level players. Uh, this, the Hall of Legend, we had the Crusher before. Now the next one is going to be Vincent. Legendary Vincent. Where's the ability to suck the blood? His enemies in battle against the uh, blah blah blah. Alright, so he's going to be pretty... F he'll be tough. So I'm, right now I'm trying to get Gizmo. Just because of the... I think Gizmo is going to be pretty good in all of... Um, Raids and a lot of damage dealing for a Hall of Legend, so that's why I'm going with Gizmo right now. But Crusher is not bad too. You can go with either one. I think Crusher is going to be pretty good in the arena, but you never know. You just never know. Um, I'm gonna do 90. Let's do a few pulls while I'm at it right now. I'll get to. I'll stay at 11 million. Oh, I got three phantom jars, so that's good. Those are always good. Masker uh, sacrifice is good, but now I have 18. I, when I first, you know, early levels, that was the pain in the ass. Everybody needs one of those things. Or actually, everybody needs like five of them. Alright, got some Leon Soul Stones, and I'm, my Leon is a 6 star right now, I'm definitely going for him at 7 stars. Oh, this thing too, Golden Mallet, everybody needs that. Alright, I think that should be good for now, I might do a little bit more afterwards guys, just to 
see if I can get anything else. I'm gonna see if I can do some raids right now. Because I'm getting close to a couple of heroes. Let's see. So Leia is 421, so I'm gonna need another 79 of her. So you get nine per day. That's like um, eight, about eight days. I'm thinking because sometimes you get two, you know. So three, all right. And Leia is a big part of my Crucible team, so I know, like, I'm definitely gonna get her at. Seven stars. And there's three more. Alright, beautiful. So Leia is done. Next. And I just go down the line like this, like always, just to check it out. See what I need. Leon. I slacked on Leon in the beginning because I didn't think he was gonna be too good. Because I thought he's gonna be like the cleric, which he kind of definitely looks he is the cleric. But the thing is the cleric in this game is good. Everybody uses him. His defensive uh, abilities are good. It gives a boost on offense, so he's being used by everybody right now. So I figured, let me jump on and get him to seven stars until he becomes, until they you know release somebody else and he's nothing anymore, like always. But for now, he should be good. Let's see, he's done. Let's see who's next. Isabel, I get in the arena. I'm not trying to get her too good. Same thing for Yulfeng. Get him in Crucible. Get him in gold, uh, guild, get her in the arena. So I'm only trying to get heroes who... Alright, so 459. So I need about 41 left of uh, Osiris. So she's getting very close. She's probably like 3... In 3 to 4 days, she will be 7 stars. The only problem is that she's not orange yet for me. She's purple plus 4. Didn't prioritize her, you know, too much but once he gets to seven stars i'm probably gonna end up you know bringing her to orange because she's actually pretty good she gives a um, magic boost and also um deals a ton of damage with her ultimate so she is very helpful in a lot of situations all right so let's see who's next vincent Erstag, I'm gonna go with Erstag right after I do um, Osiris, because I don't want to, you know, use all my um, what's it called, all my um, whatever it's called, the, your uh, stone. Not, I forgot what it's even called. Stamina. Sorry, I don't want to use all my stamina on, you know, just soul stones. I actually want to, you know, farm some items too. So. I really like to go to four or five uses per day on just soul stones and then the rest with the rest I only really go up to six because I don't want to spend you know too many diamonds on stamina but maybe four or three three or four something like that three or four on soul stones and then the rest I do for some type of a item that I'm farming And I think Alana is the last one that I'm that I'm actually farming right now. I don't think there's really anybody else that I'm farming for soul stones. All these guys have to come out yet. Oh wait a minute. Oh. So Jasmine is. So I'm definitely gonna equip this on Jasmine. I've been waiting to, to fuse her to orange for a while now. Shh. She's really good. She's gonna be very helpful, you know, when it comes to um, the Crucible. Actually, I didn't really notice if anybody else could be promoted at all. Uh, Beltor could get something here. I'm probably gonna give him. So this one gives him physical crit, physical armor, and life steal. This one gives him. Physical attack, physical crit, life steal. I think I'm just gonna go with this. Let me 
we see how Alonzo's doing here. I'm gonna have to upgrade his skills. That's good for now. Wait a minute, I think the Hanzo I can get him in a couple Yeah, so I'm gonna <clears throat> I'm gonna get Hanzo too. This speeds up the process because um, I can farm it I farm him in arena and then I can also farm his soul stones in the campaign here in Elite, so definitely speeds it up by by a lot. So I got two in that one, so that's good. So I got six. Alright. So I don't think there's anybody else that I'm trying to farm right now. Everybody else can wait a little bit. I might have to enchant somebody real quick here. And I'm going to go with Gizmo. Let's do this one. Why? I got a lot of these, huh? Damn, it takes a lot to enchant somebody at this point now. Alright, use some of these, use some of these, some of these, some of those, some of these, some of those again. And boom. Alright, maxed out. Okay, so that one's maxed out. Let's collect this daily here. So all of these uh, guild coins that you get from you know from your dailies help out a lot because you can max out everybody from your you should be able to max out everybody from crucible not in if you're a level 90 at least it shouldn't take too long so we've reached hmm i wonder if i should just wait i might just wait to finish chapter 14 and then reset that instead of ch chapter 12 again uh that's what we'll do Mercenary camps. Boom. I really just put anybody here right now because I don't think anybody's using them. They pretty much have. They have all the heroes I have. So there's no point. Fight together. Arena. And some crucible. Okay, so what do we got here? Three one here. So I think I have seven. I have seven of these uh, tickets for for the diamond pull. Yeah, I have seven. So in a couple of days, I'll be able to do a ten pull and uh, be sure to put that up. Then check my treasure here. Yes. I'm gonna put my usual teams here. Okay, this, 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 this. I'm missing somebody. I'll lay it. That should be fine. Next one. Uh, slim. And I'm gonna go with Crusher. Next. And let's do. I'll do Gizmo here. Sashi. There, boom. Orange, orange, orange. Alright, so they're all filled up right there. Now, what's left to do? I gotta do another arena, I know that much. But I'm just not sure who I'm gonna be attacking because they're all the same now. I'm gonna go with this guy here. Let's just give it a shot. So, everybody's pretty much the same. They all have the same heroes. Everybody uses Leon, mostly physical team. And it comes down to luck at the end of the day. If you're a little bit lucky, you're going to get some, you know, good RNG. And you're going to win. If you're not lucky, he's going to get it and they're going to win. So, either way, it's... At this point, you know, the game doesn't become about arena. Because it's hard to hold, you know, first, second, third. It's hard to hold any place. Because there hasn't been a big update on the game, you know, like, progression-wise in a while. So... It's not going to make a big difference. Once they increase the level limit and then people will start, you know, increasing their limit on their level. 
then it'll be a lot different, but for now, I don't think it's gonna make a big difference. So I'm hoping this Gale attack does big damage here. Ah, oh, it's gonna be close because Slim can definitely dish out a lot of damage here. Yeah, Pyo! yes, we did it. I don't know if you guys know where that's from, <laughs> but that's from Dave Chappelle. <laughs> but. Let's keep going here, boom. I only gotta do just a crucible of fire real quick here. And this is my main team that I use. It does the job every time. I've done a couple other videos on it if you wanna check those out. Okay, that was easy enough. Let's see if we get anything good. Which I haven't gotten something in a while. Nah, nothing. And I'm gonna see if I can show you guys. I wanna do a little spotlight, uh, let's see, on a certain hero here. But only if he's available. Hanzo, there he is. So this guy King Boss has Hanzo at 7 stars, yep, fully enchanted, fully maxed out. And let's check out his stats, uh, so I guess, I mean, obviously the best physical, uh, the best trait for him is his physical attack, 3100 plus another 800, so he's almost at 4000, which is really good. Uh, defense, obviously he's lacking in defense. He's not the best defender, but the best thing about him is it's his dodge. Look at the dodge. 205 normal plus 395. That is insane amount of dodge. That's crazy. I mean, if you really look, magic attacks, he can't dodge. Obviously, nobody can, but if he's facing a physical team, he's going to get a lot of dodge. And that's why he's so annoying to fight in the Crucible. I mean, he's... if. You know, you're running to Hanzo and you're running a physical team, uh, you know that you're going to be annoyed for a while because he's going to take a long time to die. Um, let's see, he's got ability level bo uh, bonus of 2, health recovery 800. So his stats are not bad, they're, all, they're really good. Um, the items are all really good actually, but his abilities... Let me start from the, I guess I'll start from the top here. Dash into enemy lines. It deals a certain, you know, it deals multiple blows. Yes. I think it goes for five times. Deal a quick accurate slash, dealing physical damage and stunning the target. So that one is a little bit car, uh, a little bit of crowd control there. Performer spinning attack, deals physical damage and lifts the target into the air. So he's pretty much just all damage, uh, guys. As you can see, the only thing why I wanted to spotlight him is because I know for the last haul of Legend, he killed it. I mean, it, I'm pretty sure that everybody from the leaderboard, whoever was running, you know, at the top, they definitely used Hanzo. There's just no way you could have done it without him. I'm not sure. I tried it. I have the other video to, to, to show for it, but I tried a, a couple of different, you know, uh, lineups and he, the one that I had him did the best. So, I think it's getting close to the end of the video here. Um, what I'm going to do next is I'm going to do some... I'm going to open up a bunch of these. Let's... I'll open up another... I don't know. I'll get to 9 million, I guess. And you guys can see, you know, what the items are here in the gold chests. If there's anything good. You do get some, like, purple items like I did right there. Which are definitely useful. And you get a good amount of soul stones too, so... You don't have to rush on some of the heroes for soul stones because once, you know, the, the gold, once the gold is, um, what was I say, becomes easier to get, then you can catch up on a lot of hero soul stones. I'm getting a lot of Leons here, which I'm kind of happy about because I do want to get them to 7 stars as soon as I can. 
Gale is already a 7 star, so I don't really need her much. Drago, I am working on Drago as well. Uh, he's a really good tank here at level 90, so if you're you know if you're just starting off there and you have a choice and you know who to go with don't hesitate to level up Drago trust me he'll become very useful and I'm gonna do one more here to see if we get anything good holy shit that uh, ancient royal sword is actually not bad at all that is a great item that is very useful I don't think I need it right now but I know it's very useful let's see I mean, the only really guys that I'm trying to go for now is, you know, Gizmo, Jasmine, yeah, that's about it. So I think that'll be it for today, everyone. So thanks for, uh, you know, watching this video. If you like the, the video, please subscribe. I have live streams going on pretty soon with Soul Hunters as well. I do live streams on Heroes Charge, and I'll have daily videos coming up. So if you want to be uh, updated on those, uh, hit the subscribe button if you like this uh, the video hit the like button, and then I guess I'll see you guys next time. All right. Peace. Love you guys